Good morning, Studio South. And it's March of 2020. And we are doing the bus terminal at Littleton Station. Now, I have to start out and say this, this is one of the more weird or inconvenient bus terminals I've seen. Let me show you why. Down there, beyond that fence, is a cut, and that's where the rail station is. So you have to come up here to the main parking lot, and then you have to come all the way over here, cross the highway bridge before you get to the bus terminal. Definitely cars have priority here over buses. So anyway, we're going to do it from here and we're going to do the bus terminal questions, which I have revised. Is there a bus shelter here? Yeah, there's several here. Are there benches? Yeah, they're definitely mostly in the uh, shelters, but they're there. Are there black terminal bus stop sides? Yes. I don't know if you can see it. We're going to try to zoom in on one. Yeah, there you go. Way in the distance, if you're the center, you should be able to see it. Is there a trash can? Yeah, there's several down there. Are there bus routes and other rail lines here? Yeah, there are. There's the C and the D for the light rail. And let me go ahead and read out all the buses that come here. Littleton's a big terminal. There's the 29, the 36, the 36L, the 59, the 66, and the 67. Is there a bike rack? I'm pretty sure there is, but I don't see it. Is there anybody waiting for a bus or a train? Well, they're definitely waiting for the train, but I don't see anybody sitting at the bus stops. Is there anything unique or interesting inside of this bus stop? Yeah, there's several things. But first, we're going to move. All right. So the first thing I want to show you is the original Lilton Railroad Station. There were actually, I believe there were two of these at one point in time, but now they're down to this one. Also, if you look, they have... An old semaphore. So the story behind the station is an interesting one. No, you really can't see it really well, but the light rail tracks are down in that cut beyond the edge of the parking lot. And on the other side of the arc, TD tracks is the joint line, which is Burlington Northern and Union Pacific. So, originally, this station, the tracks were about level with the station. Also, the, the station was also about... Uh, 50 feet to the right here and when they lowered the tracks they moved the station which is really kind of neat. Uh, inside the station is a coffee shop that's usually open uh, during the mornings.
And lastly, if I can move around here a little bit. Okay, about two blocks. Here's the park straight ahead that way. And those trees are at the edge of the park. So if you walk this way away from the camera, about a block and a half, you'll be in the Littleton Main Business District. And there's something neat about Littleton Business District uh, is that the fact that it hasn't been gentrified, glorified as some of the other places. Uh, yeah, there's definitely some upscale shops there now, but you can still see all of the old architecture And it's really kind of nice to walk around. There's some really neat little shops that you can walk into that have, how can I put it, uh, well, unusual, different, things of interest. So that really does it for Littleton. Um, do come down here. Uh, there is a lot to see. I would say spend, I'd say half day, an afternoon, Afternoons are nice, nice, warm, sunny, especially if you come back here during the summer and I'm shooting in the winter time. This is the new sun. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for watching.